Oh, Roberto, you are a sick ticket. Where the hell did you get Rieger in there? That's perfect. That's great. Honestly, one of the few you've done that has doesn't have anything to do with penis. Congratulations. Yes. <laughs> Roberto showing range, hey. if you will. Congratulations, personal Woo. development. Hey. My God. <laughs> Hard fade. Excellent. I was, I was really enjoying that music. It was he should have let the music bed. Uh, it be sounded like there. those old commercials. What was it? Passages Malibu. Yes. <laughs> Come on out, get clean. <laughs> Seventy grand a month. <laughs> but the music was soothing. It was some good stuff. I, I, I really, I, I don't know what we're doing here at this point. Um, and not, not, not the radio. I know exactly what I'm doing on the radio. I, I mean. This company. Uh, <laughs> I just, hold on. Can I take one second to just be incredulous towards something? Like, if you're out there and you work for a company, you know, and not, not a small family business, those rules are different. I mean a big company, right? You work at an office with a couple hundred people or a corporation. What What is it with these companies that they think they get to legislate your personal time? your vacation time we just had an incident and of course sully's like mr company he's got his little he's got his little intercom panties on i do not no i've i had experience with this issue before that's why i was able to speak yeah, on it i bet you do <laughs> he's got that logo right on his ball i wasn't defending this policy i, I understand it i was no, not defending no, it. no 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 you there's no way you understand it I go, like, we have vacation days, but then we have personal days. Now, you know, you get a couple. Used to get three. Intercom buys the place. Now we get two. All right, whatever. New company, new day. So be. I go to fill out my sheet. I like to use my personal days early in the year. I don't skip work. I don't get sick. I show up to work, all right? Then the rest of my year's vacation time. Sully goes, uh, actually, Michael, uh, reading the Intercom handbook, you can't do that. What do you mean I can't do it? They're personal. They're my personal dad. Do what I want. Uh, chapter three, paragraph seven, uh, rule four. You can only use one personal day before July 1st and one day after July 1st. That is correct. Well, and those aren't personal days anymore. Now, are they? Crazy. Well, I had a worse experience because I had to get a vacation advancement form. Oh, wait, but, 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 what the hell's of it? This well, isn't a cash checking place. Basically, this was. <laughs> what, what did Montel Williams come out? Well, I'd never Do heard of it. Do you need money? Need vacation days? <laughs> Read the fine print. No, but since the merger took place, I had a, I'd committed to a bachelor party a couple months away. And this was like maybe five, six weeks ago. I figured, let me just submit it in. Let me get these days off and get everything settled. Your and vacation days. My, the vacation days I have, yes. Right. And you have vacation days. You yes. are a contracted employee with vacation days. Yeah, you get a couple weeks or a few weeks, whatever it is. Uh, whatever. Depends um, who the person is. Exactly. But I applied and put, and put in this vacation days. It's never any issue. The stuff always gets approved as long as you give them a reasonable amount of time. Used to be. And I get an email from our HR director, and she basically says, hey, you haven't accrued these vacation oh. days yet. And I, it's my, my thought contract. was, yeah, my thought was, I get a certain amount of vacation days. I'm just trying to use those days, but with how the new policy is, you accrue a certain number, a certain hours of vacation days each pay period. So basically, you have wait. to wait until you accrue them. You to have, use them. you have a piece of paper. It's called a contract. Oh my god! It says what you have. Right. Here, I got something you can accrue. But if if you're trying to use your vacation days Company, be, before you have already accrued that number, them you have to wait, get an advancement form, no, no, which I get, Michael, which I did, and it got approved. Michael, but whatever. you accrue them when you sign the contract. <laughs> They're accrued. Right. They're trying to you know make it proportional throughout the year. I no, guess. I don't no, know. no, 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 no. Vacation time is not proportional. Life isn't proportional. If an employee wants to use all their days by February, that's their problem. Now you're going to go 10 months, no days off. Yep. If a person wants to be an idiot like Caputo and never uses days and just say, hey, company, screw me. 
Ah, it's his business. I know people are out there and you're at your office listening or you're driving around. Do all companies operate this way? This is new. We never did before this. What what business is it of the employer? When or how you take your vacation days? I mean, we got limits on how many days you take a row. We we got this personal thing before July 1 and after. I got Sully who's got a contract. And they're treating him like he's a parking meter. He's got to accrue the days. Brother, the adva- they were, advancement form. Brother, they were accrued the day you signed the contract. Yes, no, it specifically says how many days you get per year. So I was surprised that I couldn't use them because I haven't accrued them yet. But What do you mean? What do they pretend? Well, I don't understand. I mean, I understand it. I don't agree with it. Their Their mindset, I'm sure, is that hey, we don't want people using all of their days at the beginning of the year. Why that's, is it their business? <laughs> well, it's not, but it's what I, that's just what I'm saying. I I'll assume what, their, their reasoning this, is. This company is going to have a great time this summer. Here's a newsflash. Mid-July to late August. I won't be here a lot. You got a problem with it? Too bad. Find a new afternoon guy. Make sure you've accrued those days. Yeah, make sure I accrue them. I got something you can accrue. It's the time off sheet in Jimmy's box. Consider it accrued. What is this? Is nonsense. Oh my. Where are you coming from? Well, the thing was too. I t- I think I took like three days off for this bachelor party that's coming up next month, and what I had to do was literally write on there, I need twelve point seven five extra hours that I haven't no. accrued. No. And, and like literally to the decimal point. <laughs> no. No. He's gotta work it off. I, right. Like he's gonna be washing dishes to accrue an extra few hours. We got a business lunch coming in. All right. I got you. Just don't. <laughs> Now, and understand, guys, listen to me now. Everybody brokers their own vacation. That, that, that's, not, that's not the argument. Okay? This is not some referendum on whether uh, we get enough vacation or not. Okay, That is not where we're going with this. We all know that Americans are the most overworked, under-rewarded society in the country, or in, in the world when it comes to vacation time. My point is our, comp- our new company, I don't know what the hell's going on here. 12.7 out. What are you doing? Mike, they're in your contract. Just put them on there. That's what I thought I could do, but had to fill out an, addi- where do, an additional form. Where do companies get off dictating when you can use your vacation days? Like, do you understand the nerve you got to have? That's a ballsy move. Hey, it's a personal day, but mm, we're going to dictate when you can use your personal day. What? Then it's not personal at all, is it? I would... I would- Bet, though, that this is more common than we think. I bet you there's a lot of no. companies that, that make you accrue them in some sort of way. Not all companies, if but I bet you there are. If you're a new employee, sure. But you've worked here for years. Right. I've worked here for 15 years. Right. Not accruing anything. These are the days I have. Take I, them or leave them. I think on the form, too, they a- asked him where he was going. Yeah. <laughs> where are you going? Are you going to be responsible? Right. Right. Practice safe sex or we won't approve this. What the hell is going on in this place? Now that what if they made you do that? Seriously, if they made you fill out where you were going. This I'll tell you, this this country's headed to hell in a handbasket. It's bad enough Americans don't get nearly the vacation time they deserve. Now you're gonna try to legislate when you can take it? Well, Honest to God. I have a buddy who works at a, a company downtown and he tells me whenever he has to take days off that his director will ask him, Well, why are you taking this off? None <laughs> of your business i know and i'm always surprised by that you can't ask people that (laughs) what's your friend gonna say oh uh i'm going to thailand to have lots of sex no it's not it's no one's business right yeah i'm going to medellin (laughs) oh wait wait a second he literally gets asked about where he's going by the person who approves his vacation he does that is out of order that's out of line I thought the same thing. I really did. This country's losing its mind. Wow. And there are days that he's, you know, obviously earned and that he has. But as they'll, you know, they want him to work a lot, and they will ask him, well, why are you taking this off? Can you, do you really have to take this off? Well, Which well, is it's ridiculous. It's not your business. What is this company? I know. I what know. is this company? I'm not saying it on air. Tell no. me the name. I can't say it on air. <laughs> I have an idea. It's a, uh. I don't you, no, no. You either do it all or you do none, and for your own well-being, do none. No, I'm not. I, I said, Otherwise, they're going to mess with your recruitment. No, what I said is just it's a company downtown. That's all I'll, 
I've said. And when, all I will say. when did when did our personal time become the company's time? That's uh, ridiculous. I tell you. You know what? I'm gonna test your theory. I'm gonna go use I'm gonna go use a bunch of vacation and see if somebody's got the guts to tell me I gotta accrue it. No, I guarantee if you went in right now and filled out you know the week that you go to Saratoga in August, or, weeks plural, or maybe some other another week you're taking. I earned off. those weeks. If you went and filled that out right now, I guarantee they would come back with this advancement form. And you know what I would do? I would spell a four letter word on it that starts with an F and rhymes with duck. <laughs> those are my days. You know how much money I made this company over 15 years? I earned those days. Those are mine. They're in my contract. A crewman. This is Fugazi. That's before we get to Eric Ebron today.